the technology is taking your, your listening history, the data from your profile to another level. Explain how. So thank you for having me. We are very excited about this product because what we are doing with the AI DJ is really transforming the way people listen to music. What we have created is a personalized AI guide for you, for every single user that knows you and your music taste better than anything before and can therefore create this lineup that is really special with commentary that explains to you why you are listening to this particular song or track or artist and also tells you why you should care, right? So you're more open to discovery. And by doing so with this stunning realistic voice and this form factor of an AI DJ just for you, uh, it is able to also learn from you better than ever before. And so it takes this metaphor we've always had with Spotify of creating, you know, we've had this metaphor of what if you had your own personalized DJ, what would they do for discovery? They would create Discover Weekly, they would curate your homepage, your daily mix. But this metaphor is now a reality. So that's why we're so excited to have built this product. And it actually recommends better and learns better than anything we've done before. Users of, of Spotify around the world will be used to seeing lyrics or even video now when you have your favorite tracks playing in playlist form. But at the technology level, this is a partnership with OpenAI that provides a lot more information about the artist or, or the song. Explain how it works. So this is taking generative AI on two levels. One is in the commentary itself, the facts about the, art, uh, about the track or the artist, why should you care about the song, what's important about it. So that is one aspect of generative AI we're using. And the other one is, of course, this incredibly realistic voice that brings a lot of passion and a lot of charisma and uh, a lot of warmth to the recommendations of the DJ. So we are taking those two aspects of generative AI and we are putting them in the hands of music experts inside Spotify, which are our music editors. They are some of the most knowledgeable and passionate people about music in the world. So we take this generative AI technology, including in-house and uh, some of the work we've done with external partners such as OpenAI, and we're taking that technology and in the hands of our um, music experts, it actually brings something new to both listeners and to creators. For listeners, it expands yes. their horizon, and for creators, it introduces them to new audiences. You know, Ziad, when you announced uh, last summer that you were acquiring Synantic, many were like, you know, what's going on here? How does this end up in the platform? That's the final part, right, of the AI DJ, a voice component. Why did you do that? Well, very much so. We did that because um, when you think about our mission, it is really to connect listeners and artists and very much what we do is audio, right? So when you are doing that, you are listening to this new song, um, the best possible way to introduce you to a new song is to give you the audio commentary, the reason why uh, you are listening to that song, why you should care, and also it gives you a chance to try it out. And we have found in the data, since we have started rolling out our beta, that users who hear commentary from that stunning realistic voice from Sonantic technology that we acquired, when you hear that commentary, you are much more likely to try something new. And when you are more likely to try something new, your lives get better as a user, the artist benefits because they grow their audience. And this is happening in a way that has never happened before because in great part of that voice technology uh, that you mentioned.